Hello everyone and welcome to another MetaArts tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to disable AI enhancements in your MetaArts. We are going to go straight to the point. Before we do that, make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel. It helps tremendously to create new content, so thank you very much in advance. And let's get started. So we are going to access our MetaArts Manager. We are going to navigate to Ads and here we are going to click and edit our ad. We need to do this job for every single ad that we have under our account. Once we come here, we're going to scroll down all the way down. And once we scroll all the way down, you are going to find this option here that is called Advantage Plus Creative Enhancements. So once you find this option, you're going to click on Edit and you are going to navigate to this screen. Now here you can disable AI enhancements. Which AI enhancements you need to disable? First of all, translate text. It is very dangerous. It's not going to be accurate. Please disable it. Overlays, I'm fine with it personally. If you don't want the system to take your headlines and add them on top of your creative, you can disable overlays. Visual touch-ups, it means that the system will touch up your image to make it maybe brighter, maybe more enticing. I'm fine with that, but again, if you want the ad to look exactly as you upload it, maybe you can disable it. Add music, personally, I would recommend you to disable it because the music may be totally irrelevant to what your ad is all about. Text improvements means that the system will go above and beyond whatever primary text and headlines you provide it. So it's up to you to decide whether you want that or maybe you want your copy to be exactly as you insert it, so in this case you can disable it, and then you can scroll down animation if you have a single image, my advice is to disable it, product tags, even if you are e-commerce, they don't really work as expected, so my advice again is to disable it, enhance CTA, it means that the system will add call to action buttons that may be different from the ones that you select, and how do you know what kind of CTAs the system will actually introduce. You can click here on customize and you will see here what the system is actually planning to use. Now you cannot really change these CTAs. You can either use them as they are or you can disable them completely. So most of the time they are fine, but make sure you review them. Flex media, again, the system will crop your ad. If you don't want this to happen, please disable that and you need to scroll further down. You click here, show more enhancements, relevant comments. I definitely disable this option myself because sometimes what AI thinks is a legit comment is not really going to help your ad to get more clicks, more sales or leads. And then adjust brightness and contrast. Again, if you want the ad to look exactly as you upload it, make sure you disable that. Once you are happy, you are going to hit save. And that's it. You need to repeat this process for every single ad that you have under your ad account. Even if you duplicate the ad, sometimes the enhancements are reactivated. So make sure that you check here what kind of enhancements are there in your ads. You can disable whatever you want. You then need to publish your ad. And that's it. That's all for today. So once again, you go to ads. You go to edit your ad, you scroll down, you're going to find this option. You're going to click on edit and here you can review all the AI enhancements and you can choose which ones you like and you want to use and which ones you want to disable. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. If you want to work with me, you can find links in the video description. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day in any time zone. Bye everyone.